Today, we will discuss about all these topics. Hello dear friends, welcome to our channel, Best Project. Motor is a very important part of any kind of industries to convert electrical energy into mechanical energy to continue the production of industries. Hence taking care of motors is very important. For this purpose this system is implemented. Let us have a look on components. Main switch is used to turn on and off the entire setup. It is a voltage regulator. It is used to provide constant 5 volt DC to Arduino system. It is a Arduino Nano. It is the brain of the system. It is removable. For study purpose, it handles the entire process of the system. It is a second most important part of the system. It is a Wi-Fi module to see the data online. It takes the data from Arduino and sends it to the server. It is an IR sensor. It is used to measure the speed of motor in RPM. It is placed in front of the shaft of motor. It is an LM35 temperature sensor. To measure the body temperature of motor, it is used. It provides the temperature L in degree Celsius. This knob is a high power dimmer. It is used to vary the AC supply to vary the speed of motor. Current sensor is used to measure the load current of motor in milliampere. It is ACS712 current sensor or 5 amp capacity. This blue cube is a relay. It is used to turn on and off the motor using the Android app. It is a 16 cross 2 LCD. It is used to display all the parameters of setup like current, voltage, RPM and motor body temperature. This part is a voltage measurements unit. It is used to measure the supply voltage through Arduino. Please like this video for our support. This is a AC induction motor. It can run at 8500 revolutions per minute of speed. It is small size of motor as you can see on the screen. Time to connect the motor to the setup. If you have any queries, please ask in comment section. The connections of speed sensor is as shown. The sensor is already attached to the body of motor for ease of operation. The alignment of shaft paper and IR sensors must be like this for better speed readings. To see the motor body temperature, we need to place the sensor on the body of motor for better accuracy. For this, we will use FeeWe Quick to Stick sensor. The process is as shown here. Sensors has successfully placed on the body. Now, we will supply 230 volt to the setup. Share this video with your friends. Project name is appearing on the screen. Student's name is appearing on the screen. You can also watch other project videos available on the channel. To see the data online, we need to connect the setup to Wi-Fi. For this we will use mobile hotspot, as you can see. First go to hotspot settings, then go to hotspot configuration. Change the Wi-Fi name and password according to the code. After filling the information, save the settings and turn on the hotspot. After some seconds, it will automatically connect to the mobile phone hotspot, as you can see on mobile screen. For online monitoring, we will use Blink app. As you can see on the screen, the app setup is already complete. There are gauges for current, voltage, RPM and temperature on the app as available on the screen. This toggle switch is used 
to turn on and off the motor, we will see it while operation. Let us test the setup. Let's turn on the motor, using the app button. Motor has successfully turned on, as you can see. All the parameters are, available on the LCD screen, and as well as, on the Android app. It is voltage readings. It is the, motor body temperature. It is RPM. It is, current. Let us increase the speed of motor, using the dimmer. Speed has increased and also showing on both screens. You can see all new readings. Again we are increasing the speed of motor. Change in speed, you can see very clearly. It is working very fine, as you can see. Testing the setup, at high speed. Email us for any queries, about the project available in the description box. Now we will test, by decreasing the speed. You can see, the speed has reduced on the LCD, and on Android app. Our setup is working very fine, as you can see. Temperature is also increasing. Our setup is working very fine, as you can see. Now we will test controlling system, using the on off button. Look on the Android app and motor shaft. It is also working perfectly. We will see backside wiring after this session. Don't forget to like the video. You can order this project, visit description box. Thanks for watching the video. We will see you in next video. Take care.